Hello students, welcome to Parivartan Physics. In today's video, we will learn how to perform the experiment called as conversion of galvanometer to voltmeter. Right? So, this galvanometer, uh, now we already know in, by theory, we can convert galvanometer to voltmeter by connecting a very high resistance in series with the galvanometer. Right? So, a high resistance yes, here to that we have to calculate and then we have to apply that resistance and then we have to convert that given galvanometer into voltmeter. So, that is the aim of this practical. E practical the motive other than how to convert the galvanometer into uh, voltmeter. Clear? Okay. So, that is all about the experiment. We will see the apparatus which we have used in this experiment now and also we will see in detail about the procedure of this experiment as well as connection of the experiment and the calculations of this experiment. Right? Okay. Okay, now let us see what are the apparatus used in this experiment. So, this is battery eliminator. Uh, we know very well battery eliminator is used to convert high voltage to low voltage and from AC to DC, right? That is the use of battery eliminator. After that, we are going to use a device called as voltmeter. Voltmeter is the device which is used to measure the potential difference or voltage. And then this is another device called as galvanometer. Galvanometer is a device which is used to detect the current or measure the small amount of current, right? That is the use of galvanometer. And then we are going to use a box called as resistance box here. This is the resistance box. Resistance box is a device which is used to create resistance in the circuit and uh, to control the current flow in the circuit, right? New resistance jasti apply matter, circuit over current kadme akthadri. Resistance kadme apply matter, circuit over current jasti akthadri. Right, we are using one more device here called as rheostat. Right, this is rheostat. Rheostat is a variable resistor whose purpose is to change the resistance in the circuit. Right, variable rhythm. Now, in knob and moment, as we move this knob, resistance will vary, and due to variation of resistance, current will also vary in the circuit. Clear? Okay, next note. This rheostat is total more terminals. There will be three terminals for this rheostat upper end of the rheostat lower end of the rheostat and there will be one more lower end of the rheostat on this side. This is the lower end of the rheostat. More terminals are there. Right. Next note. This is plug key. Plug key is used to uh, start the current flow and stop the current flow. If you plug the key, current flow will start. If you unplug the key, current flow will stop. Right. So, that is all about the apparatus which we are using in this experiment called as conversion of galvanometer into voltmeter. Clear? Okay. Now, let us see the circuit connection of this practical. So, you start the circuit connection from the positive terminal of the battery in any practical, right? So, positive terminal of the battery and the red color terminal indicates the positive terminal, black color terminal indicates the negative terminal. So, notary, positive terminal of the battery is connected to the one end of galvanometer. Positive terminal of the battery is connected to one end of galvanometer. From the same end of galvanometer, we are connecting Positive terminal of the voltmeter. Voltmeter is the positive connector. Now, the junction is the junction. The junction is the total mode connections. Positive of the battery is the one. The voltmeter is the positive. The one. Plus, either galvanometer is the one. The rheostat is the lower end. Lower end. Correct? So, there are three wires connected at the same point. At the junction. The galvanometer is the positive negative. You don't worry about the polarity of the galvanometer. That's why. Voltmeter and thermometer connection code other, you have to consider positive as well as negative terminals at any conditions. Right? Okay, if you enter you can interchange matter, left side borrow deflection, right side birth. That, that's what it will happen. So nothing to worry about the polarities of the galvanometer. Next note. Uh, the connection I think. Next note. Positive terminal of the galvanometer is connected to the high resistance box. Resistance box is one the end economic connector. Correct. Another end of the resistance box in Adela, it is connected to negative of the voltmeter as well as the same uh, from the same terminal we are connecting to the upper end of the rheostat. Rheostat is the upper end economic connected. Adela. Clear? Okay. Amela, rheostat is another end notary. The lower end of the rheostat is connected to plug key and another end of the plug key is connected to negative terminal of the battery. Battery is the negative terminal connected. Adela. Right? So, that is all about the uh, circuit of this practical. So, if you have a circuit, observe it clearly. See, we can check it clearly here. See, positive of the battery is connected to one end of the galvanometer. Positive of the battery is connected to one end of the galvanometer. Uh, from the same end of the galvanometer, one connection is given for positive of the voltmeter. 
from the same end of the galvanometer we have connected to the lower end of the rheostat another end of the galvanometer is connected to one end of the high resistance box and another end of the high resistance box is connected to negative of the voltmeter as well as upper terminal of the rheostat and lower terminal of the rheostat is connected to one end of the plug key another end of the plug key is connected to negative of the battery right this is all about the connection of this experiment fine now we'll see about the procedure of this experiment okay we have to observe some things here now observations work barko bekadre illi kelavond eshtu things gal namage beka illi nodri the galvanometer of the resistance now already il barthe idive check maadi galvanometer of the resistance is 112 ohm what is the figure of merit of galvanometer illi en print maatirtarala this is figure of merit of galvanometer how much it is it is 20 microampere per division adu namage figure of merit aithu amale galvanometer scale nu solpa check maadi nodri see here it is zero here it is 30 here it is 30 so zero then the 30 divisions left side but zero then the 30 divisions right side so that is all about the scale of the galvanometer in other better next number the voltmeter voltmeter the range in order yesterday so this is voltmeter range of voltmeter is from zero to three volts that is the range of voltmeter correct okay okay now let us note down the observations which we have made in the observations were not the first observation number in other galvanometer resistance galvanometer resistance now not going to be it was 112 ohm correct you know down at the level observe my new work of a figure of merit of galvanometer a galvanometer we're going to print it at the it was 20 micro ampere per division right 20 micro ampere per division next notary number of divisions on either side of zero of galvanometer scale either side and raj zero the left side motor right side yes the number of divisions number give you it was 30 number of divisions on both the sides next notary current required for producing full scale deflection of n divisions full scale deflections antandre nodri a galvanometer ul 0 dinda 30 divisions namage deflect agbekadre yestu current bekala a current en kelatar nodri right athare id formula enade n into k n estadare 30 k estade 20 right 30 into 20 will be 600 right 600 iden micro ade a micro ila as it is etre so 600 micro ampere current namage beku yavadakare for full scale deflection next range of voltmeter voltmeter now yes range thond idive 3 volt the now range the voltmeter thond idive in next note the main thing is you have to calculate this one the value of resistance to be connected in series so ig now one the galvanometer na voltmeter convert madbekadre for that galvanometer we have to connect a high resistance in series series work now one high resistance in connect madbeku so ig series work high resistance in connect madre ee total setup namu yen anthe work madtadu pandre it works like voltmeter ಅದು ವೋಲ್ಟ್ಮೀಟರ್ ತರ ವರ್ಕ್ ಮಾಡ್ತೀವಿ ನಾವು ರೈಟ್ ಸೋ ಈಗ ಇದನ್ನ ವೋಲ್ಟ್ಮೀಟರ್ ಕನ್ವರ್ಟ್ ಮಾಡಬೇಕಾದ್ರೆ ನಮಗೆ ಹೈ ರೆಸಿಸ್ಟೆನ್ಸ್ ಎಷ್ಟು ಓಮ್ ಇರಬೇಕು ಅದನ್ನ ನಾವು ಕ್ಯಾಲ್ಕುಲೇಟ್ ಮಾಡಬೇಕು ಸೋ ಲೆಟ್ ಅಸ್ ಕ್ಯಾಲ್ಕುಲೇಟ್ ದಟ್ ಹೈ ರೆಸಿಸ್ಟೆನ್ಸ್ ಓಕೆ ಈಗ ನಮಗೆ ಆರ್ ದ ಫಾರ್ಮುಲಾ ಏನಿದೆ ನೋಡಿರಿ ವಾಟ್ ಇಸ್ ದ ಫಾರ್ಮುಲಾ ಆಫ್ ಆರ್ ಆರ್ ಇಸ್ ಈಕ್ವಲ್ ಟು ವಿ ಡಿವೈಡೆಡ್ ಬೈ ಐ ಜಿ ಮೈನಸ್ ಜಿ ಅಂತ ಹೇಳಿದೆ ವಿ ಇಸ್ 3 ಐ ಜಿ ನಮಗೆ 600 ಮೈಕ್ರೋ ಆಂಪಿಯರ್ ಅದರಿ 600 ಮೈಕ್ರೋ ಸೋ 10 ರೇಸ್ ಟು ಮೈನಸ್ 6 600 ಮೈಕ್ರೋ ಮೈನಸ್ ಕ್ಯಾಪಿಟಲ್ ಜಿ ಕ್ಯಾಪಿಟಲ್ ಜಿ ಇಸ್ 112 Right, so we have to simplify this. Okay, you can simplify more. No? See, it is not a bit in a three divided by six thousand into ten days to minus six. Now, we'll get the order plus six either minus hundred and twelve three divided by six hundred and this will be zero point double zero five into ten days to plus six minus hundred and twelve. So the zero point double zero five into ten days to six in other la it number just after the panther. This will become five thousand. So five thousand minus hundred and twelve. So 5,000 minus 112 means this will be equal to 4,888. So now we get the bantha 4,888 ohm and the number resistance bantha. Correct. So this much resistance we have to apply in series to convert that galvanometer into voltmeter. Right. I will write it here. 4,888 ohm. This much resistance we have to connect there. In next note, least count of galvanometer converted to voltmeter. And the galvanometer the least count on the value. Calculate more because galvanometer the least count on the notary. If voltage is the range just other V number three other divided by N is other 30 other. So the number three ones are three tens are it number one by ten. One by ten under zero point one ampere. So zero point one ampere under entry galvanometer will come in division. It's not really even with the it is zero other right. It's zero other is number 30 other. So zero then the one two three four five six seven eight nine ten right. Illy number ten and the other three. So it is zero the next division in other light it indicates one ampere is one one sorry one old and the meaning other right so one on the division the value is to ponder one old 
correct so this is the meaning of the least count of the galvanometer so galvanometer olage sorry 1 volt alla 0.1 volt re so one division 0 din the next division the value estu pandre 0.1 volt so it is 0 0.1 aithe id 0 0.2 0 0.3 0 0.4 0 0.5 0 0.6 0 0.7 0 0.8 0 0.9 1 so 10 divisions andre alli 1 volt aagtadre re hangadre 30 divisions andre estu volt aagtadre re 3 volt aagtadre re right that is the meaning of least count of the galvanometer now we'll see this practically andre idanna practically now nodkondu we have to fill up this observation table uh, readings in the observation table we will put in the error 0 then the practical set to be successful correct okay let us go to the procedure now now make on the circuit circuit on mode code circuit on mode mele you can observe both the uh, meters are showing 0 eradu meters namage 0 torusutta avri correct okay next note re iga first nive en madbeku pa antandre illen namage galvanometer sorry okay iga nive first en madbeku pa antandre illen namage resistance box adu ee resistance box olige nivu you have to unplug how much resistance 4888 resistance nivu unplug madbeku right yakandre now theoretically calculate madkondaga namage eshtu bandittu andre 4888 bandittu so 4888 resistance now we will unplug madona this is 2000 right plus 2000 4000 4500 4700 4800 4850 4870 4880 4885 4887 and this is 4888 right so now we have resistance and unplug so the resistance we have unplugged is 4888 resistance we have unplugged okay after this next step in notary okay next step in pantandre you should just go on moving this knob of the rheostat in knob of the rheostat new moment you will find the deflection in the galvanometer as well as voltmeter right so our deflections gana new note down markobeku galvanometer ol guest divisions deflect aitu adanu new note down markobeku standard voltmeter ol guest voltage torusathadu adanu new note down markobeku right and then we'll calculate the further things okay so now i am going to move this rheostat knob from one end to another end slowly and we'll note down the readings from both the meters i will show you that clearly how the needles will deflect okay you have new illi erad readings tagobekagutadre totally one uh, standard voltage and the voltmeter voltmeter will get voltage to the other one that better next number of divisions deflected in the galvanometer just a division galvanometer will deflection I right if we had values going on with a topic after so I will go on taking the values for all three tiles uh, three trials uh, on the go uh, in a straight away more trials going in the one but in a mill now observation table going on right okay switch on the circuit circuit on mode code ignore it namage rheostat ig already namage deflection torusathittu pa antadre rheostat na mattond end ku tagonu barri yavadadru ond end ku new rheostat ne ittukodi keep the rheostat knob at one end so that both the meters will show zero deflection right ig eradu namage zero deflection torusathare okay now i will go on moving the rheostat rheostat na moment maadkotu hogtin re igile nodre i will keep the voltage in voltmeter as 1 1 volt na voltage ittukotin re correct so by moving the rheostat knob the needles are getting deflected ee needles nam heng deflect agutha appa andre na rheostat knob ni enadalla adanna moment madadu correct okay so ig nodri voltmeter olage nam voltage estada how much is the voltage 1 volt right galvanometer olage estu divisions deflect aithe 0 kitta adu namage 10 ku poitre so number of divisions deflected is 10 that is 1 this is 10 okay for the second trial we have to again move the knob in the same direction 1 volt enithala adinige 2 volt kittu kodre Right, you keep it at 2 volt now. Okay, the voltage is 2 volt now. Right, the voltage is 2 volt. How, much, how many divisions it has deflected in the galvanometer? 0 is 20. And there are 20 divisions that are deflected. Similarly, for the third trial, we will take it for 3. 3 volt. Okay, I will keep it for 3 volt. Right, I have kept it for 3 volt. How many divisions the galvanometer has deflected? 30 divisions it has got deflected. Right, so now now we will see one the division of galvanometer under 0.1 volt 10 divisions under 1 volt correct so we have 30 divisions under 3 volt so galvanometer is showing 30 divisions deflection in the sense it is it is measuring 3 volt potential difference and in voltage voltmeter it is already 3 volts now and exactly e voltmeter yes to namage voltage in torusathathala asta voltage edu kuda namage torusathathi anta meaning red right it is showing 3 volt according to the lc of galvanometer 10 divisions means it is 1 volt. So, if 30 divisions deflect, I get the return meaning at 3 volt of the number reading towards the meaning of the right. So, this is also showing 3 volt, this is also showing 3 volt. It means 
exactly how the voltmeter is working in the same way the galvanometer is also working. That's why we can say clearly that this galvanometer has got converted into voltmeter. This is voltmeter convert the meaning. Right, we will note down these values in the observation table now. Okay, let us note down the values that we have observed in the practical. So, standard voltage work now first case it will be 1 volt, 2 volt, 3 volt. This is now 1 1 volt now increase. Standard voltage is the volt meter reading, volt meter will gain the R reading. Next note, number of deflections in the galvanometer theta. First now 1 volt it will be the least divisions deflect, 10 divisions will deflect, 0 then 10 will be the needle. Right, next 2 volt it will be the 0 then 20 will be the least divisions deflect, 20 divisions it will be deflected. Next, Standard voltage now 3 it won't again, 3 volts it won't again. Number of divisions deflected was 30. Last it bandit, end it bandit, number 30 and In next notary, converted voltage, converted voltage under voltmeter number guest, sorry, galvanometer number guest voltage towards other than other navile calculate my very vehicle. Okay, this is the voltage shown by the converted galvanometer. Any galvanometer now, uh, galvanometer to voltmeter convert my devala, a converted voltmeter, voltmeter number guest reading towards other than navile very vehicle. Correct. That's what we have to Formula is S into theta. S is the least count of the galvanometer. How much it is? 0.1. So, 0.1 into 10. How much it will be? 0.1 into 10. This will give you 1 volt. Correct. That's what 20 into 0.1. This will give you 2 volt. 30 into 0.1. This will give you 3 volt. Correct. So, now the voltmeter yes reading is the yes voltage is the same as the galvanometer is also showing. This is the galvanometer reading. This is voltmeter reading rate. Correct? Okay, now find out the error. Error note Vs minus Vc. And the standard voltmeter the voltage is the converted voltmeter the voltage. This is the voltage is not enough. Okay, this is the error check. Just to check. Okay, now you just check the error. See, this is Vs, this is Vc. So, 1 minus 1, 0. 2 minus 2, 0. 3 minus 3, 0. So, it means there is no error. It means that galvanometer is exactly working like a voltmeter. This is how we have to convert the galvanometer into voltmeter. So, result in the series resistance which we have to connect is 4888 ohm. This much high resistance we have connected in series to convert that galvanometer into voltmeter. Clear? Okay. Thank you so much for watching the channel and supporting the channel. Please keep sharing and supporting the channel. Uh, for further more practicals of physics, please keep watching the channel. Thank you so much.